Part of the reason I uh, got the Pinsgauer was because I wanted to be able to get to the middle of nowhere, enjoy the peace, uh, enjoy nature, because you really don't appreciate, you know, a warm bed and fresh eggs in the morning when you've, you know, ha you haven't been away from them. I believe it's necessary to get out into the wilderness and, and reconnect, you know, emotionally and physically instead of electronically. I'm Andre Swanson. I'm the owner of Fat Fabrications. I live in a little town called Mount Pleasant, Texas. And uh, I build accessories for a variety of European off-road trucks. Land Rovers, G-Wagons, Pinsgowers, Volvos, Unimogs. Uh, I'm capable of building accessories for any vehicle, but why would I want to compete with a manufacturer who can crank out hundreds of Jeep bumpers because they make tens of thousands of Jeeps? I weld out of necessity. I always like the build and design process. Uh, I like to engineer things, uh, make them look as good as they function. But that requires me to be able to make it work. So regardless of how many bends I put in or how many times I, uh, uh, how, how many different ways I design a bracket or a uh, mounting point, uh, the fact is all that design work doesn't mean anything if you can't weld it all together and make it function. So uh, it's not my... If, I, if it was my desire to just be a welder, I could have done that anywhere. I could have got a job right here in town for prefert manufacturing, and I could be welding together cattle gates for uh, 10 hours a day. Um, the welding isn't where my passion is. My passion is creating something functional that looks and works well. I was never told there wasn't anything I couldn't do. If I had to give any one thing credit for my abilities, it would have to be Legos. I had piles of them. Uh, whenever I put something together and it didn't work, I had to realize that there was a different way to put it together that it would work. You know, um, I had expert builders. I love those things. I lived more time indoors than I did outdoors. Um, 
But as far as my personal abilities, it's an argument between nature and nurture. Uh, was this a God-given ability or was it a God-given ability passed down through my parents? Um, I don't know where I got it from, but I thank God that I had it because there's a degree of satisfaction that comes from working with your hands and seeing something come from nothing. I'm particular about what I build for trucks, uh, but I don't think I'm a perfectionist. If I was a perfectionist, I would probably spend a lot more time honing my TIG welding skills so that way it looked like a row of dimes uh, laid in between these sections of tubing and pipe. But uh, I'm definitely uh, particular about what I do and how, I, how well it looks when it's done. Wow, that's almost parallel. The biggest benefit, I guess, to doing this is every once in a while I'll load up the truck with all my tooling and I'll travel and I'll show up at uh, uh, Tierra del Sol in uh, the Salton Sea area out near uh, Ocotillo Wells and I'll just set up shop and guys will go out and beat up their equipment and bring it to me and I give them the opportunity to go back out and play. Um, sometimes I've traveled as far as uh, Washington State from here and uh, you know built a uh, a roll bar and beamy uh, bikini top uh, support for a Laura Fardier which was a, uh, a French built uh, equivalent to a uh, uh, an ammo carrying mule that the US Army uses but uh, it's it's afforded me an opportunity to be able to travel do what I do uh, meet people that I haven't met before that I might have even done work for but had never shook their hands. So uh, being here at the house and not having a uh, shop that I have to pay for separately gives me the freedom to be able to go travel and see my customers. I'm happy with what I do, I enjoy what I do, and I charge what I need in order to pay my bills and get a little bit ahead. Um, if I ever get to the point where I am so busy I can't do it by myself, uh, that's when I'll consider taking on help, adopting a, uh, a young man or young woman who's a professional and wants to learn something. And uh, then I, you know, at, uh, then I get to mentor an art craft rather than just do a job. Due to the location of uh, my shop and how far everybody else lives from me, I don't oftentimes get an opportunity to experience uh, their uh, pleasure other than getting an email, you know, saying, ah, oh, it looks great, hey, this is nice, you know, best bumper, best money I ever spent. Um, but uh, every once in a while, I get a customer who come to me and have me just go ahead and take his truck all the way down to ground zero and bring it back and make it new. And uh, some, sometimes they, uh, you know, they've had the truck for a year or two. Sometimes they've never even seen it. They just know that they want a finished product to show up at their house. So they'll send it off and they'll get engine work done. They'll send it off, get uh, fuel injection. They'll. Uh, you know, get the mechanicals done and then they'll fire it off to me and they say, make it pretty. Um, I delivered uh, a 712M to a customer up in Washington um, just before Christmas. And he had full plans on spending a couple hours with me just sitting uh, 
and talking about the truck and asking me the little ins and outs and maybe even doing a drive. Uh, I showed up and of course the seats were still wrapped in plastic. Uh, the paint was all fresh. The tires looked clean because we actually went to the car wash before we showed up at his place. And we pulled it off the tra trailer and he was so enamored with it that he forgot all the questions that he had. And him and his son basically crawled in and out of this truck for a half hour uh, before he invited me in and, and gave me my final payment. But uh, to see him just uh, so proud of what he had gotten and uh, finally you know, waited so long for, and to see it show up just before Christmas, I mean, it, it, it pretty much made his holiday and it made ours too because, uh, you know, it was just as much a gift to see him light up as it was to, uh, for him to receive it. Want to put him in your terrarium with the uh, turtle? You let him go. Look, he's running for it. Let him put him in the water. Come here. Put him right there in the puddle. Right? Yeah, just right there. He'll figure out his way. Okay. We're not going to run him over. When I go someplace and I see something like on a bumper or a winch or something like that, or something fabricated or made, even even when it comes to like buildings, I will look at how they made. Oh, when we go to the bank, I look at the stainless steel entryway for the for the the cashier window, and I look at how they made the pieces, whether they did it this way and, or whether it was out of one piece and then they added a piece and blended it, and I look at how detailed the grinds are to make it all look flush and then I look at the plexiglass and I wonder how they hung it and I know they polish the edges but I just look at all that stuff and I kind of digest if I had to build this somebody was going to pay me to build this how would I do it I met this guy the other day he was from Houston absolutely not I'm just saying the church plays a new role in my life I've only been saved for about two and a half years um, I was raised morally uh, to be a moral individual to, to care about others uh, to be forgiving uh, I was raised very well by my mother uh, my mother taught me how to be a human being. My father taught me what kind of human being I was. The, the, the biggest and greatest message I get from the Bible is the message of love. Um, love does not hurt, does not kill, does not maim, it's not jealous, it's not uh, vicious. It, it doesn't anger quickly. Um, if you truly love your fellow man, you serve your fellow man. There's no, uh, you know, love isn't racist. Love isn't judgmental. Someday, I hope to look back on the things I did, the people I met, and the relationships I nurtured, and to find that my knowing them has been as much of a blessing as them knowing me to them. <laughs>